Hi guys, it's Andy aka FatStew from uh, blogseries.com and today I would like to talk about GSA links per minute. I came across, well actually I was pointed by Mark, one of our customers, to a thread on uh, forumgsaonline.de about uh, how to improve your links per minute. You can go through all this stuff, read and check it or you can just watch this video and <coughs> get all the crux of it pardon my French anyway let's go to my GSA and I'll show you what's what okay so the basic idea is that uh, the guys in the forum claim that we are using too many search engines and they provide too many same results basically ending up with the GSA spending threads and search engine threads on just going through the same stuff. I do agree with them and this is why I'll pick a project and I will modify it. They claim that all we need to do is load the English search engines and then just go through them and basically the suggestion on the forum was to leave just Google well my personal opinion is that Yahoo and MSN which is basically Bing sometimes give you a little bit different results than Google so I will leave uh, MSN and Yahoo on uh, if you follow the thread you ignore them, you uncheck them and you leave just Google. So I will uncheck everything else uh, and I will leave Yahoo and MSN there because I think they still produce a bit different results. Slightly. You know, uh, the Google exact match domain penalty cannot apply to uh, Bing or Yahoo and you can get quite a good uh, quite a few good links there so what I'm doing right now is going through the search engines going 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 scrolling scrolling Ooh, Jesus Christ people you did a quite a lot of job uh, a cozy excite Google blog leave it there info Lex meta crawler screw that one uh, MSN, I'll leave it, Skycom, uncheck, Yahoo, leave it, Ecosia, leave it, Google Ireland, MSN Ireland, yeah, let's leave those there, because uh, as I told you, MSN, that's Bing, in my opinion, uh, as I understand the software, that's Bing, and they do produce a different results than Google, try it for yourself, you will see. Anyways, so basically what I'm doing right now, I'm going through the stuff. Uh, there we go, almost there, almost there, almost there. We have 23 search engines. Uh, Yahoo, that's there. Google, MSN, Yahoo, US, that's there. There we go. I ended up with 33. Uh, people say that... Uh, you should have like maybe six or five but let me stick with th with uh, 23 so I will call them that uh, problem A-N-S-E-G Yahoo Bing that's how I call them so that's the first step optimization of your search engine the second step is mine tidally odd what we do, we analyze our subscription stats and if you click on advanced you should have clicked all these save successful, save identified, save verified but the important part right now is stats and show verified and let's save it to there you go, I have verified already here uh, I'll save it okay and then the next is show stats verified and successful which means successful submission and there we go successful yeah that's my version anyway save it okay so 
what is the point of this? The point of this is to identify uh, which engines uh, GSA can post more successfully than the others. So let's minimize this one. No, not so. And let's pop up verified. And let me just do a screen. Let me just somehow. So we can see. So basically, let's open up a project, modify project, edit. Ooh, boy, that's a big one. Still, there it goes. I'll just try and make it a little bit bigger than it is. And let's click on the article. Article Beach 1. Uncheck. Article Script 53. Uh, body press 116 Drupal Joomla 23 uh, Drupal Joomla unclicking you know why because this this tells us that uh, while article body press has 116 successful submissions uh, Joomla and Drupal 2 and 3 so why 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 would you want to leave them there it's just it's just pointless and then it's moin moin with the 7 uncheck it then uh, tiki wiki and check it and wordpress article and check it yad 3 also uncheck it then the blog comments there are three basically blogs blogspot one it's unchecked already and general blocks 66 which is good and text cube three why no need directory there you go, it's a big list. Uh, easy link. It's already unchecked. Uh, directory index more it's good, but my engines already unchecked. Uh, PHP Weebly. PHP Weebly, we will uncheck it. Uh, we links. Uncheck it. Web mini. It's already unchecked. X0 class field, uncheck it because it, uh, it's just pointless to submit to those. And there we have forums. This is what I'm using. Uh, burning board 2, uncheck. Uh, MVN forum, uncheck. MyDB uncheck pointless uh, PHP nuke yeah that could stay SMF uncheck pointless uh, and zoops uncheck also pointless then guestbook I don't use on this project guestbook but uh, indexer I don't yeah I use indexer here who is or statistics no, that's the wrong one. Anyway, microblog. There you go. Again, uh, a docu.com. Pointless submission. Just two. Uh, Bentio. Pointless submission. Blogtronics. Pointless submission. Uh, Gisco. Cool. Uh, Mami. One. Uncheck it. Uh, Plurk. Uncheck it. Revo 5, uncheck it. And status net can be there. Ping back. Yeah, that's a ping back. Maybe pretty much pointless, but you know, you, you get the idea basically. You get this list. You go through the whole of your project and you just uncheck. You check the verified, you check the submission stats. And you uncheck the ones that are very, very low success rate. This is how you can increase your links per minute, submitted, verified, and cool. There you go. Another trick is when you click on the options, when you go down there, check this option. Use your roles from global sites. Not identified, but submitted and verified 
these two because it what it will do it will go through this when I'm onto the options advanced it will go through this link which already identified submitted and uh, verified sites it will go through that list and use it to kind of create links so it's very powerful and guys keep in mind oh thank god that's ready uh, keep in mind when you have run GSA for quite some time it will be very 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 powerful uh, link building mechanism you start a new project you can just fracking blast away to already submitted links and you can create like 10,000 links within an hour uh, be careful of that anyway I hope you got the idea so first of all eradicate uh, search engines that means nothing ideally if you want to follow uh, the original advice stick with the Google then the next step is uh, go to the options advanced tools show stats verified and save it so you can go through the every uh, engine that GSA is capable of submitting to and just then then again you can go through the each of the projects but the big idea is that as you can see when you click on the modify project you can duplicate it so the best idea is to create a phony project kind of you know a clone or a template and afterwards when you start a new GSA project you can just duplicate that one and fill in all the relevant data there you go okay guys 12 minutes fat Steve out have fun if you want more info about blog networks check out blogseries.com Hey, hope you see there, hope you enjoy this video.